Hello and welcome back to Night in the Woods, me Barton. Last time May got herself pissed, rat arsed, flutered, langered, completely out of it. All different words for drunk and she was really was drunk. And now, so let's continue to see what happens from here. There you go. I'm sorry, Bay. I'm a mess. You know, whatever. It's not your fault. You're just a kid. I'm older than you. Two months. Yeah, well... I stayed here and got older. Well, you went off and stayed the same. <sighs> Good night, Mayday. What's going on here, eh? So is this her crazy dream? Must be. So, okay, so we're in the woods at night. How do we use the bat? Oh, we can't. Well, I don't know the button to swing the bat. Oh, that just changed direction. Okay. That was actually swinging it, I wasn't. It was just facing it away. Oh. Oh, we can't land on that. Okay. Looks like it's a stepping stone, does not it? Okay, let's just continue on. Okay. Dirt Kill. The Killersburg. I don't like the fact that Kill is in the middle of the name there. Oh, we can get on it. So, there must be a button. So, F. Oh, it is F. Okay, yeah. Right, so. Don't know why we're destroying stuff if we are. So that's a bit of a rampage for, for, for I remember I went to university with a guy and he was a nice enough guy but in our very last year our final year we had like so you do like your final exams as well so but also we did exams at Christmas time just before Christmas which counted towards your final grade and the night before one of our exams, I think it might have been taxation, but it doesn't really matter which one it was, but the night before one of our one of our exams, he went out with some, some of the other guys and he got really drunk, kind of like the way he made it. And he was on top of a car like this. And apparently one of the guys said he fell off, smacked into like the, the bonnet or the hood as Americans would say and then ended up on the ground and he had cuts and bruises all over him apparently the car was all dented and stuff but they, being students they just did a runner they didn't it didn't hang around to to see you know did they have to pay for anything or just typical students really but then what he did was he because he'd been out 
drinking all night, he hadn't studied for the exam. So he told the he told the lecturer or someone, I think the invigilator, the person who was looking after the exams, that on the way to college he crashed his bike and that's where all the cuts and bruises were from. And they believed him. So what happened then was instead of him going in and, and getting a fail mark in that particular exam, they gave him the class average, which happened to be a pass. So he did a lot better than he would have done otherwise. Okay, we can, yeah, we can break these. Nice fluorescent, fluorescent tubes. I was gonna say you don't see many of these anymore, but I live in Japan, you see them a lot actually. But there are a lot of kind of older signs that you see that they're either broken or they're just kind of there on display, they're not actually turned on. But there's parts of Tokyo that are just completely, at night time, just completely neon. Okay, so we've broken that. Can we break the... Okay. How do we get her to go? Okay, I don't think she can go down anymore. Okay, let's just continue on then. Yeah, I think I... Oh. Okay. Do that. Okay, yeah. That's what I wanted to do down here. Maybe I have to go and drop off the side. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, and then that one. So I'm not sure why she's being so destructive, even though it's a dream, but. Things were meant to get creepier, so. I think though that she's some kind of crazy mass murderer or something like that. That's what, what it's pointing towards for me anyway. Oh. Yeah, we should have done that down there as well. A trash can there or a bin, as we'd say in Ireland or the UK. Okay, got that, got a car. Okay, is that done? Yeah. Back. Okay, and this car. I never understood people who would just go and break something because they, someone else has something and they, and they don't, like just to be a dick. You know, think, oh, look at so-and-so down the road has a nice car. Well, let's wipe the smile off their face and, you know, bash their car in some night. I just, I don't understand that kind of attitude. I know like it's comes from jealousy and not wanting not wanting people to to like people a lot of the time with stuff like that they feel like the the person who has it thinks they're better than them and then they think well if I take that away from them then they won't feel they're better than me anymore but you're kind of proving by doing stuff like that why why the person is better than you but not in the same reason why they've got the thing just because they wouldn't do something like that to someone and f for me that's that person is, is better if if they wouldn't do something like that now can we knock this down so far that's a no oh uh oh that's a yes 
Okay. And what can we do? Oh, okay, we're okay. Okay, that's not do anything. Okay, I think maybe. Yeah. Okay, there's another bit of it coming. Okay. Yep, there we go. Okay, and where did it go? There. Oh. I'm feeling that the beak is gonna pierce us or something. Pierce our heart. Okay. Again. Okay. No heart piercing yet. Okay, and then that's it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, definitely getting creepy and weird. Yeah, what happens next? Part two, Weird Autumn. Okay. The whole autumn fall thing for me is interesting as well. Like obviously in the US they call it the, the fall and in the UK and in Ireland and a lot of other places they call it autumn. And kind of English people sneer at, like not just English people, people who say autumn sneer at the Americans for saying fall, but they don't actually realize that the term fall originated in England and it's just that the English language in America hasn't developed, or at least until recently, hasn't hadn't developed as quickly and changed as quickly as the English that was being spoken in England or the UK or Ireland or Australia or any of those other places where you know the, the language was more vibrant and had more kind of in influences affecting it so people said fall in England and in America but then people in England started saying autumn so the English people actually changed but the people think that fall is an Americanism just because of that but it's about time that we got up so let's do that here we go okay May well that was a weird one, it certainly was. I feel awful. I probably look awful. Well, you look the same, actually. Ugh. I'm gonna burn this room down. What? With me in it. Live out my remaining days as a sh shrieking ghost. Well, then they wouldn't be your remaining days because you'd already be dead. Yup. <laughs> okay. Okay, we've got some messages. Let's see what they are. Probably, God, you were in a state last night. That's normally, in Ireland, that's what people would say anyway. Hey. Oh, it's her. Hey. Sorry about last night. Why are you saying sorry? Hope you're feeling okay. Um, yep. I'm at the pickaxe all day. If you want to stop by. Okay. So maybe a bit of reconciliation there. Then let's see what you have to say. Hey dude. You okay? Last night was P in pretty intense, I guess that is. B said you're okay. I'm at, at I'm at Snack Falcon all day. Come by if you're not dead. Sincerely, Gregory. P.S. Ban jam later. Oh my god. 
The end. <laughs> I like his messages. <laughs> okay, let's exit. So we get to be really bad in the band again. Looking forward to that. Okay, so let's head on out. So we get to talk to mom and dad, or mom at least. Me. Yeah? Come say hi. Okay. I'm pretty sure I gave the mother a different voice, but that's me. <laughs> Never look for consistency. <laughs> You're not gonna get it. Hey, hon. You look like crap. <laughs> She's honest. Yup. Rough night. Is it that obvious? No, I was just saying you look like crap because I love you. <laughs> what? Thanks. If you want to talk about it. I saw Cole at a party in the woods. From senior year? Yeah, he was home from school for the weekend. Did you talk to him? Kinda, sorta, I don't know. Well, he's a jerk, hon. <laughs> that really is a mother, take your side and everything. No, he's not, or he wasn't. I don't know. Anyway. Looks like most of the repair workers have cleared out of town, of town center. Okay, that means we can go up to the church then, maybe. Finally! Yeah, they're all done with the church... Churchill steps. And the power lines. Great! Han, I do not want you on those things. Mom, I'm 20. Uh-huh, which means you go to jail for it. Did never catch me. Your Aunt Molly, your Aunt Molly catches you up there. There's no telling what she'll do. Did I tell you I saw her yesterday? Oh, oh, that's us, isn't it? Did I tell you I saw her yesterday out front? Really? Yeah, she was being all weird and cryptic. I don't know, everything's fuzzy today. And anyways, it's dangerous. You remember Susie Kushner? Gee, Mom, I sure don't. I've definitely never heard the story 1,000 times. Fried, honey. The paper used the word fried. Now, she can't use adjectives. <laughs> what? She lost, an she lost an entire part of speech. <laughs> How do you lose adjectives? <laughs> oh, I love it. Gee, mom, that's terrible. See, that's the exact that's the exact kind of sentence Susie can't formulate. <laughs> so, what are you up to today? I don't know. Gonna go see what Greg and B are up to. You all gonna do something together? I don't know. I don't think they hang out much. Past meeting around with old band equipment. Well, there are only so many hours and so many days in our lives. Is there some bug going around that makes people talk like fortune cookies? Friendships are like trees. <laughs> you have to water them so they grow. And we each have only so much water. Have you ever watered a tree? No, God does that. <laughs> okay, I'm out. See you later, sweetie. I want to talk to her more if we can. Yes, we can. What you reading? 
book about a guy who grew up secretly living on a fishing ship. Living in a barrel, eating raw fish, crabs, octopus, squid, lobster, gulls, albatross. Wow! Sharks, dolphins, sea cucumbers, seaweed, sand, rocks, kelp. But that's the same as seaweed, I think. Not exactly. Wow! I want to see how how far she goes. Rope, sails, one of the boats, the rigging, sailor shoes, sailor hats, sailor pants, sailor shirt, sailor underwear, clean. Oh, there's gonna be sailor underwear dirty then. Wow! Fishing line, fishing nets, fishing poles. Jeez, he was well fed. Several dugongs and a manatee. <laughs> really? Which are different, you know. I did know that. And that's a list of everything he ate. How do you eat fishing line? The crews thought the boat was haunted. But nope, just a barrel boy. What's the book called? <laughs> it's gotta be something really stupid. Barrel boy. <laughs> Barrel boy. <laughs> Oddly enough, I, I now want fish sticks. <laughs> I know, right? I'll have your father bring some home. <laughs> okay, let's see. Yes, we can talk again. Great. Mom, I love these conversations. By the way, why doesn't did she go up on the sit on the thing for the for the actual one? Have a nice day, sweetie. Ah, guess we're finished then. Yeah. See you, Mom. Never change. Okay, so we're outside. We're gonna head straight for the two people we need to talk to. So let's... Be our... Yeah. Oh, hang on. Hey, Selmers. Oh, what kind of voice did we give her? I can't even remember. Did I see... Did I see you with a journal the other day? Oh, yeah. Doctor's orders. Yeah. Yeah, Dr. Hank has me doing one, too. Oh, okay. Did you have anger problems, too? I was stealing, I was stealing painkillers from the Ham Panther Pharmacy. Oh jeez. So Dr. Hank sees journals as a general cure-all. Is it working for you? Nope, rehab and the program do though. And I've become a very good poet. <laughs> That's nice. Wanna hear one? Yeah. My heart is a darkness, a dankness. But when I see you, I feel a thank thankfulness. What? Wow, that's really nice. When I feel a blueness, all I need is a you-ness. That's very romantic. <laughs> it's it's about my horse. Oh, we just friends. I'm sure you are. <laughs> okay, let's leave you to it. <laughs> On we go. Oh, did we just kick him? I think we just kicked him. Okay, well, we're going up here. Let's go to the two stores. We did the two stores and then I think we'll end the video. So not the pawn shop. I'd like to listen into them, but we don't really have time. So I'll do that later. We'll have the time then. Party bar, let's pass you. Oh. Wait. Hopefully we didn't pass by her store. But if we did, we get it on the way back. Okay. What the? What? Past abilities is closed. No! 
No, 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 no! Past abilities is gone! No more pizza delivery! No more Big Sal! No more special birthdays! This is the worst thing that's happened to this town since the flood that took out... <laughs> what choice do we get? <laughs> yeah, the mini golf ice cream place. Summer nights. Eating ice cream. Playing some putt-putt. All washed away. I am so freaking depressed now. Yeah, poor past abilities. We never even got to go there. Oh, do we have to talk to you? Yeah, you're in the way. Why are you in my way? Hey, Jeremy? Jeremy Wharton? No one calls me that. Jerem, right? Jerem Warfare? Oh, that's stuck, huh? Yep. That's an okay name. Your name is May. Yep. That's an okay name. Okay. <laughs> You were like a year behind me, right? Two years. So you're fresh out, huh? I hang out with Greg sometimes. We ride bikes. I'm pretty good at it. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what that's supposed to be. That's what I knew. What? I saw a rabbit possum the other day. Really? Where? It was crawling across the road. Had it been hit by a car? Nah, just rabbit. What happened to it? Got hit by a car. <laughs> wow. It was like a poem. Okay. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, let's go to Snack Falcon. Hey, Greg. How's she hanging? Well, look who it is. Yep, alive for another day. How are you feeling? Was feeling pretty bad, but I've been across town and I don't know, that helped. Fresh air or fresh as it gets around here. Delicious. So, what's that? We gonna head out to band practice? Okay, so you get to practice with the band. So I think what I'll do is we we'll practice with the band, then we'll end the episode, and then we'll go talk to Bay. I like how Bay's eyes follow you around. <laughs> okay. So what are you doing? Practice. Yes. I crashed my back once and broke a spoke, went through my leg. Jeez. It was kind of cool. Oh yeah, I can see that. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's get practice going. All right, kids. I gotta head out soon. Where are you going? Family stuff. Oh, okay. Just for a night. Okay, we doing this? Yeah, let's do this. Wait, I don't know the song. <laughs> like, at all. And I barely remember how to play bass. You'll be fine. I completely will not be fine. Zero self-confidence, huh? No. I just don't know the song. You stupid jerks. That is the name of the song. Okay, hang on. One. Oh, four, four, four. One, three, three, one. Okay. Oh, I got a couple 
right and pass in our place and then not. Sorry for the lack of commentary, but I'm trying to actually hit some of the notes. That requires too much concentration. Every time you even think about talking, <laughs> I mess up. Okay, but I did better than the last time, but still terrible. Wow, me, that was uh, pretty bad is what it was. I literally do not know this song. <laughs> Okay, so let's have a quick chat with everyone and then I think we're done. You want to do something tonight? Um, I promise I'll be an improvement on last night. What were you thinking of doing? Uh, um, want to go to the mall? The mall? Yeah, Fort Lucene. Like we did when we were kids. When's the last time you were at the Fort Lucen Mall? I don't know, five years ago? Yeah, uh... What? You know what? Yeah. Let's go. Great! Pretty sure the mall is gone. Yep, great. I promise I'll be, it'll be great. Okay. We sure we're doing this? Let me check with Greg real quick. Because that sounds like... Okie dokie. Yeah, that sounds like... It's going to be... Something that ends the episode. So let's have a chat with you. That was pretty loud. Oh, that was pretty loud. Is that good? Loud's fine. <laughs> okay. And then we won't talk to him until the next episode. Because... It's going to set off. Well, let's see what he has to say and then decide. Hey, hey, Duder. Angus leaving for the night? Yeah, gonna be bored. Or rather, I would be if I didn't have plans. Plans? Crimes. What? Oh, crimes? You up for some crimes? Hmm. I might be hanging out with Bay. Let me check first. Cool. Let me know. Okay, so I think we're going to hang out with Bay because they, they've got more stuff to sort out than with Greg but that's going to be it for now for this particular episode so again this game is just so much fun and I'm having fun playing the game and also doing the stupid voices and getting everybody's voice wrong and stuff like that and I, I'm just having fun <laughs> with that just mucking about but that is it from me so as always if you've enjoyed the video please consider hitting the like button you know pick a friend that you think oh if you enjoyed the video, pick a friend that you think, oh, maybe they'll enjoy it too. 
send a link to them and see just check because that's how a small channel like me grows really you know i'm not gonna suddenly be like a million subscribers or something it's just one subscriber at a time or one view at a time even but as i say that's it so i really do hope to see all of you next time goodbye thanks for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it if you did maybe you'll hit the subscribe button there on the right and check out some other videos here on the left